Excuse me. Oh, can't we just skip work and go back to the hotel, please? Oh, I wish, love. Fortunately, we've got a factory to open. So, are the bosses? Can't you ever do it? Well, what kind of example is that to set your workforce? I don't feel like setting an example today. I want to be naughty. But Mrs. Barlow. What, am I neglecting work for pleasure? Yes. Yes, I am. No. Oh, all right. All right. The real world beckons. Oh, well, if it isn't Casanova himself, they are, love. Been hearing all about your romantic prowess. Oh, yeah. Here. Oh, I love what you're doing here. I thought you were meeting Fred. Oh, we cancelled. Oh, all right, so you thought you'd skive off, did you? Well, I'm tired. I can't concentrate, and that's your fault. Uh, I'm going to go and take the recycling out. What are you doing here, anyway? Listen, Slacker, I owned you a dinner hour. Somebody's got to look after that factory. <sighs> yes, boss. Hey, yeah. Try and concentrate on the drink. <laughs> oh. Can I get you some, Matt? Uh, yeah, I'll have a tomato juice, please, Liz. I'm just going to nip outside for a ciggy. Hey. I don't hear Tina, it. Tina, wait, look. Come on. I, I feel terrible, all right? Yeah. Oh, poor you. Oh, come no, on. You know, I've just, to, I've just had to listen to your wife saying what an amazing time she's had. In detail. But you know I wanted to be there with you. Yeah, you know well, that. you're with there with Carla, so. But she found out about the booking. I've told you, what was I supposed to do? I'm such a flaming idiot. Hey. I'll make it up to you. How many times have I heard that? Tonight. I've got plans. What plans? What plans you got? I have got a life, you know, and everything revolves around you. Look, I know I'm not in a position to pressure you, but... OK. I'll be in Slate Street at 6 o'clock if you change your mind. And I promise you, Tina, I'll make it worth your while. You in charge. Yeah, I know, but I sent all my emails and I got bored. I know, but even still, it's not like you to do shopping. Well, not for food, anyway. Oh, well, today is your lucky day. Oh, is it? Yes, it is. I'm going to cook for you. No takeaways, no packets, no hidden chefs involved. Oh. I thought you said it was my lucky day. Ah. Listen, I know I'm not a regular in the kitchen, but well, I just wanted to do something special for you. Oh, you do enough for me, love. Anyway. I have been Googling Indonesian cuisine, and I am going to make you the most amazing London cap gum you've ever tasted. London chap go my, would that be? Yeah, that's a little fella. <laughs> hey, I'm telling you, you never want to ask a fresh girl's assistant for a girl on girl. Gal and gal. <laughs> I know, I'm only messing. So, all right, the plan is, OK, we do food, mm -hmm. we do compliments to the chef, we do more compliments to the chef, and then... We pick up where we left off this morning. Mm. Wow, that sounds great. Mm. But the thing is, love, Jimmy called again. His wife went round to get her stuff and they ended up having a blazing round. Now Jimmy's staring at a bottle of whiskey, so... I'm sorry, I'm going to have to go see him. Oh, I understand. That's fine. Um, uh, I don't suppose you know how long you'd be. I mean, we could always eat later. Oh, it's, it's just a few hours. Oh! Oh, that's all right, then maybe you say eight. Eight it is. Hmm. Give you plenty of time to burn it, then, won't it? Oh. Oh, I wasn't sure if you were going to turn up or not. Yeah, me too. 
So why did you? Do you need to ask? No. Come here. Right, let's go. Where are we going? Well, I've only got a couple of hours, so there's a B&B &B just round the corner. Unbelievable. What? Carla gets a night at Summerford... No, no. My night at Summerford Lodge, and I've got a couple of hours in a B&B. &B. Well, look, what, what was I supposed to do? I couldn't just magic a night away Why from... not? Why not? Because she's cooking dinner. <laughs> because she's cooking at dinner. Yeah. Who flaming cares? You don't give a damn about me, do you? Oh, no, that's not true. Come on. I right, prove it. Tina, do... come on. You know how much I want no, to No, no, I, I know what you want me for, Peter, but what is that? It? No, of course that's not it. Tina, wait. Where are you going? Away from you. Wait. What? Wait for what, Peter? What for? Look, I, I don't know. I don't know what to say. I never promised you anything. This was right. Liz, what, what do you mean? What does Liz know? What, does, does she know that we're back on? Oh, you're really worried now, aren't you? Who cares if Tina's upset? Suddenly you give a damn because you think Carla's going to find out. Look, just just tell me, what exactly have nothing! you told Liz? Nothing! I said nothing, Peter! Right. But right now, I reckon that I should have... Where are you going? What are you going to say? Just wait! <laughs> <laughs> 